Alrighty, we're back. It's been about a about a week since I last recorded, and so my my poor player here is just sitting here waiting to move forward in the plot line. So hopefully we can get through this cave before this episode's over. I took a quick glance at the team. They're exactly where we left them off in the previous episode, and we got spinach out here ready to start uh, doing some work. I am excited to hopefully get a uh, leaf stone soon. I would really like to get this uh, to get spinach to their final form before this, you know, gets super far into the game. And here's spinach just kicking ass. It's, it's great. It's awesome. Getting to 25. Really sweet. Okay. Let's go ahead and switch out. I think pineapple can probably do some work here. I know I'm low on potions. One super potion, one hyper potion. That's it for that. I think one orange berry. Yeah, one of those, one citrus berry. So we don't have a ton of things that can heal up. Worst case, I will escape road out and uh, move on. But I would like, <laughs> I would like to not have to do that. Speaking of escape ropes, here we are. All right, let's keep, uh, let's keep going. I believe this team is pretty strong and ready to keep pushing through the struggles. Starting to get close as well to those levels where Geodudes or Gravelers might have self-destruct, which is a huge concern. I've played plenty of Nuzlocke where something just up and self-destructing can kind of wreak havoc. Um, so hopefully that does not happen. Raveler would fall under that category of people that I'm worried about. I'm also worried about this magnitude if it uses it um, because, you know, when you're underground and you're hit by Earthquake or Magnitude, as far as I know, they do more damage. Ooh, magnitude 8. Not excited about that. Please don't hit hard. Oh, that hit much harder than I want. Shit. Alright, I think I'm going to use this moment to use up my super potion because I really don't want to lose pineapple it's been really holding its holding its own here and I don't know I just don't want to you know don't want any deaths oh perfect magnitude four Little weak ass magnitude. And then dig for the win. Awesome. And we'll keep moving forward. Alright, uh, I know down into the left is where I need to go. I'm just gonna keep pushing word on this. Um, oh yeah, let's go ahead and uh, try to kill these a wild geo dude or two. Since I'm so close to a level, it'd be nice to get there. There's pineapple making minced meat out of that geo dude. Keep going, keep going. Just a bunch of rock smashable rocks. I'm probably just gonna leave. I know I could try to 
look for items that might be hidden there, but I just don't feel like trying to deal with that right now. Oh, this dumb geo dude. Also, very intrigued that I haven't uh, really run into a Geodude um, in one of my cave encounters so far. So that's, uh, that's pretty interesting to me. Alright. Um... Okay, Soracha. Old friend biscuit. Oh bugger. Okay. Come on. There we go. The Sriracha now having both Confusion and Aerial Ice, I think um, they're really going to assist Bacon in taking down the next gym. So I'm excited about that a lot. Come on, Sriracha. We do not love the Jigglypuff. Ugh, you're a moment last. Sriracha's just... Sriracha's a lover. Holy shit. Okay, um... Yeah, so, not a fan of that. I'm going to go with Pineapple, because um, Pineapple has really awesome defense. It's going to take this roll out to the face. It also cannot be immobilized by love. And screw this Jimmy Buff. Damn thing. I'm trying to kill Sriracha. Oof. Pidgey. Well... I guess Pineapple is just going to hang on out through this. There we go. Come on. What do you got? Let me yell. Whatever. It's fine. Adios, meow. Okay, I know there's a TM for Rock Slide around here somewhere, but... Okay. But I might skip that part. Okay, Sprouch is pretty low right now. Um, Fudge. I do not have a lot of options. Honestly, I mean, I should kind of go back. I think I should go back and heal. I should have bought potions. Not a great choice by me. Um, uh, man, I just don't, I don't like these options. And I don't really have a lot to heal with. Oh, I hope I don't regret this. Alright, let's do this. Luckily, Squash is one of the fastest pokes in the game, so we can get out of that. Okay, I need Squash to... Just crush everything. I need to not take a hit. I need you to get higher than sevens. Nice. It's a good start. Keep it up, Squash. I also know Squash. I think, 
I think squash can take care of everything. I just need good rolls. Come on, squash. Good rolls. Eight. Another eight. Beautiful. Get it, squash. Nice. So close. Oh, fucking graveler. Man, I don't want to deal with this graveler. Oh, it's going to hit so hard. And Squash has, like, such little HP that I'm just so worried that this Graveler will take it out. Yeah, Magnitude 7 on Squash at 22 HP? I bet you any money it would have killed it. Pineapple's defenses are just so rock hard that I think it can, it can handle this. Come on, Pineapple. Nice, it wasted a turn. If I was that Graveler, I would have just been magnituding my life away. Come on. Oh, so close. Alright, survive this, survive this. Ugh, eight. It's gonna hit hard. Come on, Squash. Whew. That's rough, that's rough. Alright, here we go. Come on, do enough. Was that enough? Yes. Oh, thank goodness. Sweet, Squash is at 26. I am running out of so many Pokemon to use right now. Everything is so weak. Oh, hell yeah! Squash is evolving. Now I'll have multiple Squash. Come on, Squashy Poo. Biggest thing I hope is this gets somewhat of an HP boost. Because Squash is good, minus the fact that it has no HP. So when it gets hit, it's like, done. Sand team. Um, I mean, it's not great no matter what I go with. Sand team. Nah. Nah, sand team's not worth the strife. Let's look at our buddy squash. See? Already like 14 more HP. That's awesome. First level 26. Speed is killer. It's got decent attack. I like it. Squash is doing some good stuff. But we're going to switch out to somebody else because I need my Pokemon to survive. Is there anything else down here? Probably. But I don't see it immediately and we got to keep moving. Doesn't look like we're going to get out of the cave today, everybody. But we'll, uh, we're getting close. I think what I'm going to do is, uh, yeah, you know what, I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm too worried that I'm going to lose a Pokemon, and I have no, no healing items, which is just poor choices on my, uh, on my part, so we're going to use the escape rope, we're going back, we're going to heal, I'll run back to town, grab just at least a handful of potions. And we'll pick back up right where I left off, or right near where I left off, uh, in the next episode. Because I just, I don't want to lose Pokemon. They're trying so hard, I got a new sweet evolution. I, I already know there's going to be some key battles, especially against our bloody rival Greg coming up. Uh, so we're going to have to make sure that I am prepped and ready for that. Having Squash in the team has made it pretty good for this chunk, but I am kind of super concerned about how the whole team is going to hold up against uh, certain trainers and gyms that are about to come up. So, all right, we're going to call it an episode here. Next time uh, I pop on, I'll probably be back in the cave roughly where we were, and uh, we'll, we'll be able to get to the end then. So thanks for watching, and have a great time. See ya.